Yo guys, what is going on? Back at it again. This time talking about Synergy Mod 14.1. The complete review on it, my likes, my dislikes, the features, the new features, whatever. But before I start, I want to say, have any of you guys heard Childish Gambino's new album? In my opinion, and this is my opinion, I think it's pretty dope. Like 8 or 9 out of 10. Now a lot of my friends don't like it. I think he's taking a different approach, but for me personally, I like it a lot. Now I have Synergy Mod running on my Nexus 6. And the weird thing is, once I booted it up and everything, it doesn't come rooted out of the box so you have to reroute it i guess i've been out of the rooting game for a while but give me a few weeks and i'll drop some super dope videos about android but overall smooth performance like no hiccups or stutters or anything but i did have a one crash and it was in the file manager app now i usually use root browser which that also has some issues i guess all file managers have some issues where they don't load properly and they don't so, so sometimes i would want to unzip something and i would click the file but it would just lag and i would have to click the home button like seven times for it to unlock but other other than that everything seems to be working fine the camera the flashlight the Wi-Fi the speakers everything seems fine and nothing out of the ordinary I'm still on the nightlies though obviously because they haven't came up with a stable version but so far I would say it's it's pretty stable now I haven't used it like a hundred percent inside and out so keep that in mind but when you do update the camera always takes a hit whether going from stock Android to a custom ROM phone there's always going to be some kind of downgrade in the camera but in this camera I couldn't really tell the difference the Nexus 6 doesn't really have a good camera to begin with but I mean I don't think it's that bad on uh, Synergy Mod. Now Synergy Mod 14.1 is based on Android 7.1 so that's pretty sweet and some features that come with that are a double tap to wake if your phone supports it in stock so like the LG G4, LG G3, all those phones that already come stock with double tap to wake that will also carry over to Synergy Mod. Now weirdly enough the Nexus 6 does not have double tap to wake like straight out of the box but this did come with it so I found that kind of weird. It also has raise to wake you could, you're able to edit the status bar and add icons and whatnot. Uh, there's not a lot of icons yet though like you can't put the volume panel in that which is one of my favorite features unfortunately it doesn't have that but you're also able to edit the nav bar a little bit not a lot like you're going to set custom actions to the home button right now and that is on a hold so when I hold my home button it turns off the screen but my back and multitasking buttons they don't do anything at all you can't edit those and you're also able to turn on the phone by hitting the volume button so that's pretty sweet I always love seeing those type of features in ROMs I don't really know why how do you cut off but I'll just continue it on my iPhone but my my ending thoughts are that Sanjay Mod 14.1 is pretty good. It might crash on you, but it really hasn't for me, you know, besides those few apps like uh, File Manager and Root Browser. But if you want to update, I mean, I'd say go for it. But if you're on Sanjay Mod 13 or any other Marshmallow or even Lollipop custom ROM, I would hold on like a few more weeks to upgrade to this one or any other Android N ROM simply for stability. Because Android N just came out like a couple weeks ago, it's not really like up to date I would say and all the little things that probably are going to go wrong eventually haven't been worked out yet so I would say hold off and I definitely wouldn't upgrade for like better battery life or better performance or anything because you'll probably not find it in signage in mod 14.1 hopefully in the future that'll eventually happen but guys that's pretty much the end of it make sure you drop a like if it helped you out in any way if you want to help out this YouTube channel shop through the Amazon affiliate link so you can help create so much more content for this channel it doesn't cost you any extra money but it definitely helps out this channel make sure to add me on instagram and snapchat those things are on the screen so you can go ahead and follow me on there i love all you guys and hopefully i'll be able to catch you guys in the next video peace out